Hello everyone, welcome back. So, so far so good. I think everyone can follow the video tutorial. Okay, so let's add the next variable. The next variable is sex. Okay, so we have male, female, and missing, missing category. Okay, so we, we want to represent one for male, two for female, and nine for missing value. Let's add this. So the number, uh, this icon represents the number category. Click on it, then click it. So we want to choose sex variable sex. Give the name sex with a small letter. So length one, we want to give one, two, and nine. So one digit is enough. Now we don't use range we use labels and missing value okay click new one will be may click it now click plus sign two will be female click it click plus sign now this will be should be nine now this should be missing and we also want to give specific value label. So this is our sex variable. So we will give sex. Click OK. Now, as usual, we will put as mass under. Now, remember for the categorical variable, go to a standard and click on always show big list during entry so meaning when you enter the data api data manager will show you which options you have to enter in a field okay let's look at it click apply click close now close this okay save this and close this project now let's go back to api data entry client so let's say we have 23 name is smith age is let's say 16. now when you when you go to the sex variable api data will show you the option of the value which value what, what options what is the list option that you have to enter here so we can choose whatever we want so Smith, it is a male, so we will choose one. Okay, great. Now we are saving this, so we have now three records. So far, so good. Now let's close this and open the most recent one with Control Shift One key. Now let's look at our links. The next one is registration date, it should be valid. Any, with any date in the year 2018 date variable represent this calendar icon so click it here then click around here say registration date now we we'll give this a shorter name rack date now our miss our range will be uh, January 1st 2018 to 31st uh, December 2018 now this will be a mass under fee so suppose we our registration can have or can also have a missing value okay so let's uh, define this click new let's put this missing value okay so it's specifying 30th December 1899 as a missing value or you can choose 0101 0, 0, 1900 as a missing value this will be our rec date so change this name rec date click OK click apply click close now save this and see in Epidata entry 
how this will uh, whether it works or not okay thank you for watching see you in the next video